Hello, good people of the world. My name is Carlos Jones. Welcome to the new gameplay of At Tim Burge. Found this game on the Epic Games um, launcher, game store. Um, it's not sponsored, but it's just kind of cool that when I logged in and count, they were giving out free games for a limited time for the next few weeks, starting in January. So they actually first gave out Subnautica, and then they gave out Meat Boy, and then I wasn't. Sh and then the next time I logged in, they gave him, they gave out Atom Burge, and I thought, hmm, looks pretty cool. It looks like something out of um, Metroid Prime or Metroid. So I thought, you know what? Let's play it. All right. And uh, I already, I already tried a bit of the game, even going into the like the first boss. But after that, I don't know what it's about. Um. What? Oh, anything about it? So let's get it. Yeah. Wait, hold up. Okay. Oh, okay. But that you see that on top. That was my first game. Okay, New Mexico, two thousand five. I didn't quite get the story at the beginning the first time I looked into this, but. It looked, it looked it was kind of confusing because like the guy's a scientist. Trace I've charged charged and ready. Things can be starting to pause now. If only it would work this time. It looks like a pretty decent game to be honest. So like what's going on? Like what are they doing? Like, where is that? Are those like batteries? Looks weird. The beam was completely traced. There's a problem. What? What's that sound? There's an explosion? Like, I'm a boy. So, there's an explosion in the lab? As the buildings collapsed on top of me, I knew it was over. The life of the cool was all written. So, there was like an accident. There was truly the end. It just died and stayed there. Well, let's just say that everything would have been a lot different. Right, that's true. Yeah, this is where this is where I, this is the beginning of the game. At first, I was confused. I was like, "What's that?" But it's pretty much where you save the game. Trace, pick up trace. No, I think I think we are trace. No, I think like, we are trace. Oh, what happened? Trace, there is a gun in its room. Oh, that appeared like a few times. I think it's a person, it's a woman. I think. Well, by the shadow, shadow, like, it's a pretty good one. You must get it. Wait, what's going on? Where are you? Hello? Where am I? Oh, okay. See, you press up to save. It saves the game. Alright. It's getting dandy. I just gotta get my controls right. Okay. Um, when you actually first start the game, um, it has the controls for the little um arrow controls to be your base game. But when I'm playing here, it's my lap. I'm playing on my laptop. I would have to be putting my hand right here in the bottom left, right of the co of the keyboard, and that's kind of um awkward. So I changed it to W W A S D, and this is for moving. And when you have the W for which is pretty much like the up button, and the up button just look up. Um, I had to change it because um, when I like moving, I like move. I like having the the up button to be able to jump, and I moved it to the space bar so that when I'm looking up, I can just press the space bar. Okay, I said it was. Yeah, I think she said it was in that room. I think remember, I remember seeing yeah the room with the gun is over here. I don't know what those symbols are. Let me some alien thing, you know. Let's change disruptor. A high tech back mechanoid weapon. Use P. Use cushion. Yeah, I changed like the P button for shooting. And okay. This is this the gun that was like mentioned, or is it just measuring her? Sorry, I have very, very, you must go now before he finds you. You are who finds me. That's right, who? What's going on? She's gone again. 
Okay, I wasn't sure what it said about being on the part. I might have to go check back in the options to see what it's all about. But yeah. This is, these aren't harmful. They just like grow back up. And see what I'm saying? Like, when I'm using WSD, the W or the arrow, up arrow button would normally like have you look up by private as a jump. I have the, I changed it's the up button to like the face bar. Alright, let's keep going. To be quite frank with you guys, I'm not really quite sure what this game is about. I mean, they were in New Mexico, and now they're. It looks like this. Is, this looks like a, like a alien planet. To be honest, if any of y'all want to like maybe hit me up in the comments to see what the lore of this story. Okay. But you know this, and like I said again, this game really reminds me of Metroid. Like Metro Prime, though, to be the classic. It's very similar. I'm, I'm really fond of like 2D like uh, platform games. Um, it's pretty fun. Okay, for the most part, here in the beginning, I kind of know where to go, where to do, because I, frankly, I kept dying, and I kind of suck at games, so I kind of redid this part, like, over and over again. Like, in my first time playing, I would just go up to that thing, and the creatures would, I don't even know their names, but they would, like, destroy me very quickly. Oh, damn it. As you can tell, I suck at this game. But you know, this is a try and error. So, let's just keep going. Let's just keep going. Huh, what happened? You died. We saved your mind machines. What? I'm sorry, man. I think I hope I understand something. Could you try replacing that? Hello? Man, it's insane. I died. Am I still me? I don't know, buddy. I if that was in real life, but whenever you died, some just revive, you get revived. It's crazy to think about. But yeah, guys, as you can tell, I suck at this game. Well, we're just getting started, so I might get better. You never know. All right. All right. Let's be smart about this this time. All right. Oh yeah, I'm not sure what um if there's a specific like saw um like machine that you should be using this game or you should be playing in this game, like a specific laptop or computer or software that you should be using. Right now I'm using um HP notebook or I think it's notebook. But you should be able to um Use this or uh, play this game in various like things. We so hard. Oh yeah, um, you saw those little like red dots that were on the screen after I killed an enemy. Apparently, those are those are life. Like this life that you can regain back. And uh, I'm not gonna touch that because last time I touched it, I lost some health. My bad, but I forgot it was there, so. Oh, uh, this one's, uh. A doogie. Let's see. 
Let's be smart about this. Alright, now let's, let's kill them. Let's get rid of them, yes. Let me rephrase that. You know, I'm pretty, I'm pretty excited again. I'm really fond of these platform games, you know. They're really fun. See, like, like I said, Metroid, Metroid, um, you still even have a little map on top. I think this is our first upgrade. Yeah. Go to use P. Oh, yeah, this is like a gamma ray, but gem beam, ball beam. But whenever you click P again or the shooting button, whichever you want to choose, it explodes. Pretty useful, pretty useful. I don't know, I'm not sure like the mechanics or like how much damage this specific does, but it is what it is. I feel like this red gun is much better because I like to fire quicker, quicker rate. You see, I don't want to get close to them so much, so using this one is much better because it allows me to stand my shot, you know. It just takes time, you know. There we go, finally. Let's just keep going. Oh, look at our help bar. Oh, scary. Awesome. All right, let's keep going. I don't know. What did you say? Cut off the side. Oh, there it is. All right, so now we can, I guess, yes, go here. All right. Yeah, I remember this part. Those little dudes are kind of hard to get rid of. All right. Okay, I don't want to do this. Oh, here they come. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, this is one of, oh no, 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 no. Run, run. Run. You can, like, do directional shots. Oh, these guys are scary. These guys are scary. These guys are scary. Oh. Okay. Game save, yeah. Well, yeah, the game saves each time you die, so that's good. Okay, where were you again? Um, wait, I'm not sure. I forgot if there was any other place to um, use the gun specifically. You know how it, you can range the attack, range the. Attack and maybe open some different doors, so let's find out. No, remember, you can't go there yet. There's another item that we need to get before we do that. Over here? What was over here? Yeah, we can go through here actually. With the new weapon. What's over here? It's a new place. You know what? I'm not gonna go through here yet because I kind of want to go see what was. Well, remember, I want to see what was the other side. I want to see what was the other on the other uh, room. You kind of take this one one step at a time, you know, like taking an order. And whenever you guys 
Whenever I play a game, I want to take everything in one way, in one direction. Okay. Okay. Now if I can treat these, get rid of most of them. Oh crap. Oh, okay, they got closer, so that's good. Is it reach? Yeah, it's reaching. Yeah, I was actually looking at YouTube, well, like this morning. Well, right now it's like 12 15 p.m. Um, but I was looking, I was looking at this movie, um, Ballad of Buster Scrubs. Oh no. Oh, what did I do? Okay. Okay, so tab. And then, oh, okay. I know that, but I guess tab is um the. Oh. My sister, my mom's walking to the room, so. It's just. So. Okay, um, I guess tab is the. Map button. Just gonna remember not to keep pressing it. Press one. There we go. Okay. Okay. Chill out. Hold up. It shouldn't have taken that long. All right. Oh, do we hear any noises in the background? It might be my sister. Don't mind her. Ah, uh, what is this again? Apparently increases pre size size weapon. Uh, don't know what that is, you guys. I, mean, I don't know what it like does. Does it make like the the Text bigger or something? Oh. Oh yeah, that looks a bit different. Correct me if I'm wrong. It looks at the when it spreads. I feel like it looked like there was like um. It looked like there was a like a bigger range, you know, bigger bigger range. It went there. Upgrade so. Oh crap! Okay. Yes, and that thing is going through here. Yes, sorry, right. see, buddy. Okay. Uh. Okay. So we can't go through it yet. Those things are vicious. They like jump back and forth, and it's very hard to kill them. You know, it's not hard to kill them. It's very hard not to take any damage when you do. I don't know how long I want to make this gameplay. This first part, um, but if I have any, oh, what is it? Nani. I just walked in. Oh crap. I just remember on the left side, before going into the over here, there was a save module. Oh, it looks like a save module. This little thingy that goes. But yeah, that was a save thing. So if I die right now, I have to go start from, go from the beginning. Not so far though, so that's a good thing. Um, Alright, so guys, it's the first boss. I don't know what their names are. I could search them up and like. I'll tell y'all next time, but all right. Okay, so crap, I'm trapped. Demon. 
Whoa, hey, you can't talk? Listen, I am lost then. I feel like he's like saying this on nonchalantly. He's like, Demon Ito, say kill. Oh crap, hold up. Okay, I guess we're starting, okay. Okay. Might be a horn. At least pretty toes, okay. Oh, oh yeah, they'll explode, okay. Very hard to avoid them, but we'll, we'll complain. Um, mark my words. I mean, case in point, I mean. Oh, uh, those things. Okay, look, I like it when they get stuck up there. Not, and they can't get me. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. I'm already gonna die. Crap, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I feel like fighting this guy, I already beat him, which is awesome, but um, I feel like fighting this guy is uh, a bit hard to do with the second weapon. It just feels really like... Maybe the... Okay. But... You know what? I'm gonna try this, this next second time, but I feel like the red one is a bit hard to fight this boss with. In my first... Um, Encounter with it, you know. See, things much faster instead of this one, where I want to I want to fire quicker, but if I fire, I fire quicker, I just end up slowing it like really quick. So I guess it's just really good for like um long range um fights, you know. Okay, it was right here. Yeah. Yes, chess, chess. All right. You can't go through there. I love that guy. All right. Found Caret. Yep. Now we can. Now we don't have to go from all the way over there to go all the way over here. Much quicker, you know. That's now one would, would be so loud right now. It's kind of night, so gotta be considered, you know. Oh my gosh! Darn it! Gosh darn it! It's kind of hard to beat. I'm very real with y'all. It doesn't even give you like a health bar, you know. And that's why I don't like some about these games sometimes because I don't know how many, how much more you have to do this. For example, um, if you ever played Earthbound, Mother, Mother, Mother. with with Ness, um. By the way, I love that game, and I've never beaten it because every time I try to um, play it, my save files get corrupted. I think the farthest I've got into is um, getting to the last character unlocked. But yeah, like like these kind of those kind of games, these are similar to that when you're fighting an enemy, it does not give you like the amount of like. Uh, health that it has left, you know, and so you're just left wondering, like, oh, am I almost gonna beat it, or am I close to beating it, you know? So, I mean, maybe I could, like, if y'all guys want to, I can calculate how much time is needed. Oh, crap. Or how many hits? Oh crap! Am I getting close? Probably am. Just maybe I have. To, maybe I have to pay attention to like the little light, right, little right light of uh, flashing. Oh crap! 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 I'm like one hit away. If we're dying. Oh, we got him. Second time. Second try. 
You guys don't know how many times I died playing this first time. Alright, gave, gave us our, our whole health back, so that's awesome. I think this is the third. Uh, well, this is a good time to live it off. You know what? I'm gonna go back here all the way to the save, and then we'll end it up for the first time. I think this is our second. No, wait. No, hold up. Gun was first. The little exploding thingy. And the white, white, the little blue thing that told us that our permanent um, damage or weapon thing was higher. So I guess this is the third one. The third upgrade, right? And use that. Or is that? This one, I think. Okay. Yeah, all right. Oh, by the way, you can actually, like, look down and tag down. So it's cool. This is like a drill, so pretty cool. Yeah, I think, and I remember this, you can't use it to attack, so, pretty easy. And, you know, it's not like a different, like, um, option to, um, game, like, option. That's pretty cool that you can use it while using your gun. Alright. What is that? What is that? What is that? Oh, what is that? Increases weapon and damage. Oh, okay, so that okay, our damage is right now. Awesome. Like the first time I went through this, I didn't even like read what some of these things said, so I was just picking them up and be and going cool. Okay. Wait, where, where are we now? Okay, that was the boss, that was the save. I just want to know where it's supposed to go from here. Yeah, I'll leave it off in a second, guys. Okay, this is like... Where you come in, right? Okay, up top was the upgrade. Over here was another upgrade. Here was where we started. You to the side, yeah. I mean, that was up, but yeah, I had the little blocks, the little blocks you can break with a drill. All right, cool. Uh, let's see. What's going on? Can I not click it? All right, here we go. All right. I guess, I guess that's where we save and we are going to end it up, guys. Um, Once again, name is called Atium Burge. Looks like a pretty good fun game. Like, like I would have experienced so far. And and you guys should play it. And if you guys wanted me to keep playing more of this game, just uh put it in the comments, you know? Put it in the comments and if you want to um you want me to like put this game like on full screen, um I can do that. Um you guys don't have to keep looking at my ugly ass face. This is for everyone, or you can, you can, you know, or you can just keep looking at my awesome face, you know. That was cringy, I'm not going to do that again, sorry. Okay, but, yeah, um, hope you guys had a great day, good morning, night, wherever it is, and have y'all a good day.